two of my WEC 46 predictions uh, takes place this Sunday, January 10th, at the Arco Arena in Sacramento, California. Um, the main event, Jamie Varner versus Benson Henderson to see who the WEC lightweight champion is. Um, also, the return of Uriah Faber and Mike Brown after his loss against Jose Aldo. Um, overall, I think this is a good card uh, to start the new year for the WEC. Um, it's not bad. I'm excited to see it. Excited to see Faber, Brown, and especially the main event. So, yeah, I think it's a pretty good card. Um, so, let's get this going here. I'm going to do the preliminary bouts like I did last time. Just say who wins. Um, and then for the main bouts, who wins, how they win, and which round. So, let's get this going here. Uh, in my, uh, I have Will Camposano versus Cody Wheeler. I have Camposano. Uh, George Root versus Eddie Wineland. I have George Root. Mark Kominick versus Brian Carraway. I have Carraway. Wagney Fabriano vs. Clint Godfrey. Wagney uh, Kishia Tamara vs. Charlie Valencia. I have Tamara. So now to the main bouts. Uh, Mackin Simza vs. Tervidis Toro Servicius. Um, I'm not sold yet on Mackins, even though he did submit Wagney. Um, I know Wagney is a great Jiu Jitsu guy, I guess you could say. Uh, but I'm not yet sold. Um, I, I want to see more of his skills uh, first, maybe on tougher opponents. Um, I, I don't think Tavidis is going to expose Mackins, so with that said, I got Mackins, even though I'm not sold on him, second round submission, I'm going to say triangle. Um, next, Dave Jensen versus Kamal Shalaris. Uh same thing, uh, I don't know much about these ones either. Uh, Dave Jensen, I know he's a ground guy, wrestler, uh, he did beat Rich Crunkle Richard Crunkleton in his last bout by decision, um, he pretty much... I don't want to say destroyed Carlton, but uh, I don't think he won one, one round. I think Jensen won 30-27. Um, and then Shalaris has won four of his five fights by knockout or TKO. So, um, who's going to influence their game plan first, I guess you could say. Um, but, at the same time, I'm not yet. I don't know. This one's a tough one because I don't know much about either of them. Um, so, I'm going to say... I'm going to say Dave Jensen by decision. Um, I think his wrestling's in a, I think he's going to take Kamal down. Kamal hasn't really fought the competition that Dave Jensen has either. Um, I do know, um, I did go look at their records, and some of the names I didn't really know who they were for Kamal, and Dave Jensen I did uh, notice a few. So I'm going to say Jensen, unanimous decision. Um, next, Mike Brown versus Anthony Morrison. Ooh, I feel bad for Morrison. I really think Brown's going to just destroy him. Um, I know that's not really good to say in mixed martial arts, but at the same time, Mike Brown's coming back. He's, I want to say he's pissed off, but he's motivated, that's the word. Motivated to win, get back on the title hunt, and Anthony Morrison is in his way. Um, I don't see Morrison winning this fight at all um, in any aspect. Uh, I give Brown the advantage in stand-up, speed, power, wrestling, jiu-jitsu, everything. And with that said, I have Mike Brown coming back strong with the first round knockout. Um, now the return of Uriah Faber as he faces Rafael Asuncio. Um, a lot of people are like just tagging along against uh, you know Uriah Faber. Uh, I understand that he's motivated. Uh, his last two fights were lost to Mike Brown, but Rafael Asuncio is no joke. Um, he's really good on the ground. He's aggressive. Um, uh, so I'm, I'm not told. I'm not sold 100% on Faber. Um, I, I could see Rafael winning this, um, but. I'm not really sold on Asuncio beating Faber either, so... Um, at the same time, I think do think your Faber is going to get his game back. Um, I do see him beating Rafael Asuncio. Uh, Faber is motivated for this fight. He's ready for it. Um, I think he's going to take uh, Asuncio's aggression and use it against him. Um, I think Faber is really good at countering. Um, I think he's definitely faster than Asuncio. Um, so with that said, I'm going to say Faber, second round, TKO. I think he's going to catch him with something. Um, then start punching him while he's on the ground. And I think the ref's going to stop it. So Uriah Faber, victory in his return, second round, TKO. Um, now the main event, Jamie Varner versus Benson Henderson. Um, this one, um, I don't know, you guys might not get what I'm saying, but I don't like Varner. Um, I do like Henderson. So I'm not making my prediction off of why I like Henderson and I hate Varner. I'm not making that prediction. Um, I usually, when I first saw this, I picked Jamie Varner to win, even though I despise him. But um, I looked at it more in depth. Um, wrestling, I think they're equal, um, even though Varner's stronger. I think he's stronger than Henderson. Uh, I think Benson's faster than Varner. Um, Stand-up-wise, I give it to Varner. Um, 
the way he just dismantled Rob McCullough, I think definitely gives him the advantage in the stand-up. Um, Jiu-jitsu-wise, I give it to Henderson. So it's kind of, you know, they're kind of equal. Um, it's like who's going to really show up their game. Um, the only thing that gets, that kind of made me lean toward Henderson was Varner's been out for a while. Um, Henderson just came off fight with Donald Cerrone. He's been more active. Um, is Cage Rest going to affect Varner? We don't know. Um, but he has he has been submitted before Varner has against Hermes Franca, but that was a long time ago. So I don't see Henderson finishing off Varner. I do see Henderson winning this decision very similar to the Sharoni fight. So um, I pick Benson Henderson to become the WC lightweight champ. Um, I made that pick off of Henderson, I think, being faster, um, being more active, and I don't know if K Dress is going to affect. Um, Varner at all. I really don't. So, with that said, Benson Henderson, unanimous decision over Jamie Varner. So, let me go through these real quickly. Um, I have Will Camposano over Cody Wheeler, George Roop over Eddie Wineland, um, and my upset pick, Brian Carraway over Mark Kamenik, uh, Wagney Fabiano over Clint Godfrey, uh, Akishia Tamara over Charlie Valencia, um, in my main bouts, I have Mackens Simza versus uh, over Teritas Turosavicius. Um, I have Dave Jensen in a unanimous decision against Kamal Shalaris. Um, Mike Brown in a first round knockout over Anthony Morrison. And Uriah Faber, second round TKO over Rafael Asuncio. And in the main event, Benson Henderson, unanimous decision over Jamie Varner. So, there's my predictions. Um, I think I'm going to make my ultimate fight my fight night next i don't know i i don't know so um enjoy the video i'm out see you later